Richard Murray is South Africa's top triathlete and is on a quest to dethrone the best the globe has to offer on the World Triathlon Series. The effervescent 26-year-old knows with every event he participates in, he is closing the gap on the competition and getting closer to yet another podium finish. Last year we had, uh, I had a good showing there. I came second behind my training, training partner, Maria Mola. There's definitely, you know, racing in front of the Brownleys um, on, on home turf is, uh, is always a difficult thing. Uh, you know, they've got the mad support behind there. And, you know, going in there, you know, I've learned a couple of things from this year. You know, I'm a little bit over eager sometimes. I've got a bit of ADD problem from, you know, now and then. And, you know, I definitely need to hold it back a bit on the run. You know, I like to go all out and just, just give everything from the start. But I think I'll, I need to hold it back a little bit and, you know, um, pace myself correctly in, in the run to, to, to get the performance that I want. Being a strong runner and cyclist, Murray has always had to focus on the swim as it is an aspect of the sport he is eager to improve on. I'm very positive about it, you know, I spent a lot of time, it was my first uh, winter I've had in four years now. Um, I went to Europe uh, for, for a big block, um, you know, I put in a lot of work, um, it was really expensive and, you know, I needed, I needed to invest, it was an investment in myself and my career. And, uh, you know, I spent all that time overseas and I only got 15 seconds quicker on my swim, but, you know, that 15 seconds is closer on the bike and puts me in contention for the run. So, um, you know, I'm definitely confident and uh, I think some of the guys are seeing as well, my best swim in, to date in Cape Town, um, I was only about 15 seconds off on the swim. Uh, so definitely, you know, things are moving forwards and, you know, for me, that's, that's a big thing. The Commonwealth Games bronze medalist maintains that there are many talented triathletes coming through the ranks in South Africa. The one thing we always look back on too is that the, a lot of the international guys will say, oh, how do all these South African guys come through sometimes? Because they realize, they look and they say, yeah, we probably, you know, the funding side, we're not the strongest, you know, on the coaching side, we're not the strongest either. But, you know, we're, we're a very strong nation, we're a multicultural one. And, uh, you know, it's definitely, we, we've got that passion and that drive. Um, and, in, you know, in sports and things, we definitely put, all, we put it all out there. We, we never hold back. Um, so there's definitely, you know, the talent and, 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 and the skills that we have in the country are amazing. And, you know, to be able to hone, hone that on further, further along the line towards uh, Tokyo 2020 and, uh, you know, further, um, I definitely think we've got the ability and stuff. We just need the backing and, and the insight to actually drive that forwards. South Africa's top triathlete is putting the final touches on his preparations before he jets out for the sixth stop on the World Triathlon Series in London this weekend. Richard Murray is aiming to go one better than in 2014, where he finished second in English capital. CS Duplessis, CCTV, Johannesburg, South Africa.